Previously on Talking Tom and Friends, Tom and Angela finally confident they're a good couple. We have proof that we're a good couple. We're the best. We're totally right for each other. Couple moment. moment. But that confidence is rattled when a burrito-related injury launches Ben and Xenon to the top spot. Oh, hands, hot, cheese, hot. We're less interesting to the viewers than right. burnt hands. And it's going to be hard for you two guys to trend like Ben. We'll be back on top soon. In order to determine which is the best couple once and for all, I, the host of Couple Clash, invited them to compete on Couple Clash. We said we'd do this show. Look, are you going to be here all night? Will I or won't I? Find out right after this theme song. Ah! <laughs> What is Ben's favorite film? Oh, that's easy. Science the movie. Ready again. <laughs> oh, Zini. At this rate, we're sure to be time. Tom and Angela, all the way. Ben and Xenon, S-T-I-N-K. Woohoo! What's that bell? <gasps> ben, you are not going to like this. <laughs> <laughs> Will you two be quiet? We're trying to study for the show tomorrow. So are we. We're practicing our victory cheer for when we annihilate you guys. Annihilate us? <laughs> That's a laugh. <laughs> Next question, Hank. Okie dokie. Uh, what size shoe does Zedad wear? Simple. Her left is a wide seven, her right is a standard eight. <laughs> guys, being a good couple isn't about knowing a bunch of weird, boring facts about each other. It's about having a strong personal connection. Bam! Connection! What are you talking about? Angela and I are so connected, we finish each other's... Tom's right. Huh. Xenon and I have an excellent connection. An excellent internet connection, maybe. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Next question, Hank! I've got one for you. What does Xenon's hair smell like on a warm summer day? That's a ridiculous question. Huh. Not if you know the answer. Angela's hair smells like strawberries on a warm summer day. I know that because I can actually smell her. Aww. Aww. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, Ben, he can smell me, because I'm real. Uh, I'm real. I'm just not in the same location as you, okay? We'll see about that. Anyway, sounds like the two of you have a lot of work to do. Come on, Angela. Let's go actually hold hands. Hmm. What's wrong, Benny? Your emoji use is down 23%. I guess I'm just thinking about Tom and Angela's personal connection. You saw the popcorn thing, right? But there's more to a good relationship than neat old popcorn tricks. Maybe. But what if they ask us something we can't answer because we're never in the same place? Well, what can we do? There's no way to know all the questions. Hmm. Wait a minute. Turbo <gasps> <gasps> keyboard. Shield your eyes, baby. I have a bright idea. Welcome to Couple Clash, the show that tells you which couple is the good couple and which couple will... Break up! Break up! Break up! Break up! Ooh, this is so exciting! We'll finally find out who's a better couple. I don't even care. I just like that the audience gets to yell. Hmm, Hank, how come you're not in a couple? Oh, I am. I have the TV. It's educational, it's entertaining, and it's always there for me. Babe? What's wrong? <gasps> no! Babe! Please! Code Blue! Uh, give me a cable, guys! Stop! Tom, Angela, Ben, Xenon, let's get clashy. Hey, you look pretty relaxed for someone who's about to get crushed by a better couple. And the better couple is us! Oh, really? Bad couples is what? What? <laughs> Well, at least they got one question right. <laughs> Ooh, sick burns, everyone. Now it's time to start Couple Clash. First question, if your significant other was a flavor of... Strawberry Frosted. Correct. Huh? If you could name... Pink, Pink Hummingbird Wings. Wow, you guys are a good couple. Forest Green. Correct. Kyoto Japan. Correct. A toe ring. Correct. The exact moment a cucumber becomes a pickle. Correct. How are they 
doing this? Set the bad couple. We're not a bad couple. I'm sorry that's incorrect. Babe, after all we've been through, don't quit on me. Come on. Don't quit on us. Hooray! We're missing couple clash. Did you even check if it's plugged in? Ginger, please. I think I know my own TV. I need you to work with me here, baby. Could you? Welcome back to Couple Clash. How are we feeling about our first place couple, Ben and Zeno? <laughs> and what about Tom and Angela? That's not fair. We shouldn't break up just because Tom missed a few questions. Hey, it's not just my fault. I thought we were losing, you know, as a couple. We are because you're so slow on the buzzer. All right, watch this. Next question. On a boating trip, your significant hey, other... <laughs> Sorry, you can't just yell out random words. The correct answer was... That three-cornered hat! Correct. Nice going, Tom. Break up! Break up! Break up! You know what? Maybe this chanting mob is right. A good couple wouldn't lose to Ben and a computer. Excuse me, one more time. I am a real person. Fine. Then maybe we should listen to them and break up. Fine. Break up! Fine. Break up! Fine! Oh, we have a breakup! <laughs> Congratulations, Ben and Zeman. How does it feel to be this week's winner of Couple Clash? What have we done? never seen Tom and Angela so miserable. I think the worst part is that Tom and Angela are broken up. <sighs> we, we have, have to, to tell, tell the, the truth. truth. Uh, I know, it's tough. I just got out of a relationship myself. It hurts, but we move on. You just need to get your mind off TV. My darling! Uh, I missed you so much. I know I said I was over you, but I wasn't. I can't quit you. <sighs> Who ate all my ice cream? Oh, right. <laughs> Guess I'm sadder than I thought. Oh. What now? Hmm. The diner? Rhonda, your text said you were offering free ice cream to sad people? Uh, got your text, Rhonda. Uh, ah! mm. Oh. Uh, what's going on here? I'll tell you what's going on here. I just made 20 bucks. Ben? ben? Internet connection of Xenon? Great, so there's no ice cream? Well, in a way, your ice cream is the truth. Sorry for the deception. It was necessary to lure you both here together. Ben and I, uh... Oh. Um, we cheated on Couple Clash! <gasps> what? You did what? Yes, we did what? We were worried you guys had an advantage over us. So Ben hacked the show's question database. It's true! We memorized all 27,352 possible answers. That's how we were able to buzz so quickly every time. <laughs> Wait, you and Xenon know 27,000 things about each other? That's so many things! Wow! You guys really are better than us. Great, you're the perfect couple. No, we were intimidated by you. Always holding hands, always smelling each other. You're the perfect couple. No, you're the perfect couple. You are the perfect couple. You're the perfect couple. You're the perfect couple. You guys are the perfect couple. I know Stop it, guys. What if we're both perfect couples? Uh, <sighs> wow. Oh, that's deep. Does this mean you two can get back together? Because we feel really guilty about this. I don't know, Ben. 
You may have just broken us up forever and ever. No! Come on, please! Well, that's what happens when you cheat. Oh, there must be something we can do to make you change your mind. Hmm. We'll organize the best double date ever. Uh, Laser tag! Well... And a movie marathon! And all the popcorn you can eat! Deal! Deal. <laughs> Two couples united by a game show designed to break couples apart. So, was the game show a total failure? Was this strange turn of events my plan the entire time? Sadly, no. Either way, I guarantee this couple of couples will not be invited back to Couple Clash. You will subscribe. You will subscribe. I want to learn from the smartest guy in the world. What? Come on! I really want to apologize to everyone. What? Ah! Ginger. Oh, stop!